Hello, Aries. That's my lady from my lady's way tarot. And I'm coming to do your weekly weekend. Sorry, weekly love reading for the week of February 7th through the 14th, 2022. The cards I'm using today are what are these? Mm, Fairy Lenormand Oracle Cards by David Corsi. And I'm closing off with my Mystical Manga Tarot by I heard keep them. Mystical Manga Tarot by Barbara Moore. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, and subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. All right, more foes. Let's get this show on the road. All right, what's going on with the Aries? Aries, Aries, Aries. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right, endings, okay? So I do feel like definitely some endings going on here. Somebody's clearing the debris, okay? I do feel like somebody has some kind of money coming in that's going to help them in this uh, situation, okay? All right, so we got card number six here, okay? Oh, I do feel like something is getting ready to end, but I feel like I'm not certain about this situation. I do feel like there is some change. I do feel like... I. Feel a little bit of loss, okay? For some of you guys, it has been a, a real loss, a, some some kind of illness or something like that. Um, but I do feel like somebody just could feel like things are over and they don't know what's to come, okay? Hmm. Ooh. I'm an Aries. All right, so we got card number 26 here. So I do feel like some kind of secrets is getting ready to come out or they already have come out, okay? Um, we got the Ten of Coins, so I do feel like there may be some money connected to this, okay? Money, possibly movement, possibly job movement, and I do feel like some could be going on. It could be about money, okay? Um, but I do feel like I'm leaving a situation. I feel like I'm unsure, uncertain about this, but I do feel like it's going to bring in money, some money, okay? All right, so this is card number 26 also. Yeah, it represents secret knowledge and learning, okay? So it's like I know a lot. I know I can do this. I'm, I'm well diversed in whatever I'm moving into. But just changing things, are scary. it's scary. I don't like to change things, but it just happens. Some get ruined for me to change it, okay? So we got card number 32 here. So um, this... Eight of Hearts makes me feel like, yeah, somebody's moving on with a situation. This is also a card of luck, the card number 32, okay? So I do feel like some kind of luck is getting ready to come in. Um, somebody's getting ready to run, um, go, like, to their dreams, okay? Gun, I want to say run, go to their dreams, you know, try go for their dreams. I do feel like with this time... You're going to get there, okay? But when you get there, it's something new, unsturdy. Um, You don't know what to expect, and you're just shaking, okay? I'm shaking about this situation. I don't know what to do or how to do it, and I do feel like, ooh, it's just like a quick bump, a quick bump up, and I feel like it's like uh, shocking, okay? And I do feel like it has to do with some kind of secrets, and I feel like you're getting ready to get kicked up real quick, Mm -hmm. I do feel like it's something that you're going for, but you just don't know what to expect when you get there. All right, so we got card number nine here, okay? So with this card number nine, this makes me feel like some kind of gifts, bonuses, some kind of um, appreciation is coming. But this card number 32 is also about recognition. Um, so somebody just could be telling you how much they appreciate you and how much you deserve. Oh, yep. I do feel like that could be just it. That warm feeling, that good feeling. And I feel like with this feeling, I feel like you're not just recognized by one person. You're being recognized by a lot of people. Okay. And I do feel like that's what this cloudy feeling is about. It's just like, I feel like. Somebody here, they know a lot, they think a lot, they feel a lot, they are awesome at something that they do, but they don't feel like they deserve what they're getting, okay? So it's like, they. I feel like I wanted something, and I feel like I'm being pushed into that thing that I want, and I feel like I'm scared to move, 
and that's what's holding me back. But these people are pushing me into something that I'm, I'm not supposed, well, I feel like I'm not ready for, but I am ready for, but they, I feel like I'm not ready for it. They know I'm ready for it. Okay. Um, so this could be you pushing somebody that you care about, that you know, that you love into doing something, um, no, into taking responsibility for something that they are into or something they're doing. Okay. Um, all right. So we got card number 16 here. So I do feel that's the luck. Where did I see? I felt luck when I seen this card. Okay. All right. So I do feel like luck is getting ready to happen. I do feel like it's going to happen sooner than later. And I do feel like some kind of... Uh, Excuse me. Uh, some kind of emotional balance is coming here. Okay. So I do feel like somebody is getting ready to be taken. Um, I feel like I hear taking control of, taking into consideration, um, taken seriously. Okay. But I do feel like with all this going on, I feel like I'm just scared and stressed out because this is something new. I don't know what to look for. Okay. But I do feel like I just saw somebody actually like being pushed out of somewhere and just start running. So definitely somebody getting ready to hit the ground running. So it's like somebody scared of something that they already been doing. Okay. Don't worry. All right. That's another luck card. We got card 17. We got stork, the stork. Okay. Um, so this makes me feel like, like I said earlier, some kind of um, delivery, some kind of moving forward, some kind of new situation i do feel like um some kind of lucky box is going on here so mm, you got some luck going on so just move forward with that i think that's awesome okay beautiful yeah so somebody's scared in the mug somebody is very scared about what's going on somebody is very scared about something that they feel like they was pushed into that they knew they can do, but they didn't know they can do because they didn't know. You know, it's like the unknown scared somebody away from something. And I feel like somebody being snatched up into that situation. And I feel like with that being snatched up into that situation, good things are on their way. Like I said, I saw you hitting the ground running and, um, yeah, definitely some success behind that. Okay. Dang. I thought I got rid of the glare. I didn't change the camera view. So now it's back, but I'm a Try to fix it back later. All right, let's see what's going on with the Aries. What's going on with the Aries? What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Aries, Aries, Aries. These are the mystical manga cards. Barbara Moore. All right, two of swords reversed here, of course. They can put lead you to water, but they can't make you drink, okay? So it seems like somebody's pulling you to a situation where they know you're good for it. Um, but of course, it's on you to actually move forward with that, okay? Um, to actually uh, take the choice. Like, you don't, you don't have to sign no papers unless you want to, okay? All right, so we got the Seven of Cups reversed here. So I do feel like somebody has a lot to choose from. I feel like you're recognized by a lot of people. Um, but I do feel like you got your mind made up about what you want to do. But of course, it's still a choice. I can pick all these places, all these uh, whatever people, but I'm going to pick this person. I already got my mind set about where I'm going, okay? Where I'm going, what I'm going to do, okay? So we got the moon card. At this point, it's still a secret. Maybe some Pisces, strong Pisces energy here. Pisces, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Mm hmm Yep, moving forward. Okay, so I do feel like somebody's going to move forward with this situation. Of course, it's a choice. But for the majority, I do feel like they're going to move forward with this. And I do feel like there's going to be no problems. Okay, no problems. Let's see what's going on with this Seven of Cups reverse. One card, please, for the Aries. Oh, definitely some heartwarming stuff going on here. Like all of a sudden, I just felt so appreciated that I wanted to start crying. Okay, so somebody loves the appreciation here, but I feel like I'm I'm sad about the change. Like I don't want to change. I don't want to go nowhere. Okay, I just want to sit here and do what I'm doing. But I do feel like if I move forward... 
I just don't want the change. But I do want to do the work because I know I can do it, but I don't want the responsibilities con connected to it. I don't know what I'm going to be looking at or looking forward to, okay? So we got the Queen of Cups here. So I do feel like with this Queen of Cups, I do feel like more bonds and relationships are getting ready to be developed in this time. Let's see what's going on with this moon card. All right. So we got the Seven of Swords here. Of course, with every uh, bit of success you got, you're going to have some snakes trying to crawl up your back, okay? So beware because there are some snaky people around, okay? Um... I mean, it's crazy. The farther you go up, the more you got to watch. And I do feel like that was one of the things that you are scared of. I already got enough people to watch me and worry about me right now than to step up and get even more. Like, I'm not... What the heck did I do to my camera? Like, I really tore this thing up. Like, I don't know what I did. But I messed up everything. Sorry. Let's keep going. So... Last card here, we have the Three of Wands. So some kind of moving forward. I feel like somebody getting ready to drop everything behind. Move forward because those ships are definitely coming in, okay? All right, so we got the Knight of Swords reverse here. So I do feel like at this point, you're going to have less people watching you. But I feel like it's going to be more people watching you at all. Uh, also, okay? Um, I feel like the, the majority of the people watching you is watching you for inspiration. And I do feel like you got some people watching you trying to feel, figure out, um, what you're doing wrong. Okay. So everybody, farther you go up, the more of those problems you're going to see in any situation. Okay. All right. So we got the higher for car reversed here. So it looked like at this point, I have not signed this contract. Um, somebody's just looking at it. Um, I do feel like somebody may have to delete a previous contract before they get this one. But other than that, that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising size. Thanks for watching.